Hi guys, today I am sitting at my open house and I thought I would use the time wisely and produce another video for you. I always want to provide you as much information possible so that you feel my service is valuable to you. So today I want to talk about the actual home purchase process for buyers. Um, and there are nine steps that you need to consider. Number one, get pre-qualified. Talk to your lender and see if you get, can get pre-qualified before you even start with your home search. That will give you an idea of how much you can actually spend uh, on the house and if you're um, looking at homes that fall within your price range. Once you are pre-qualified, um, my recommendation is that you find a really good realtor that you can work with. Someone that is located in the specific area where you would like to live. That realtor um, should be a subject matter expert. He, would, he or she would be able to provide you information on the local market conditions, the price ranges of various homes, like the average price per square foot of a home, schools, crime rate, um, things to do around in the neighborhood and um, shopping opportunities and, and any other information that is um, valuable to you. So find a local realtor and um, you can always call me if you're looking to buy a house in the Jacksonville, Ponte Vedra, San Augustine area. With your realtor, you can discuss the price range, the ideal location, uh, local market conditions, and ask any questions about the actual home purchase process um, to your realtor as he or she will be um, the person to guide you by your side from the start till the finish of the process. As a realtor, I have access to MLS. So MLS is a database uh, or search engine for realtors um, with the most recent information on active uh, listings. I can set up a search with your specific search criteria to send you information on available homes in a specific uh, neighborhood that, where you would like to find a home. So I would uh, set up the search. You would get uh, constant emails uh, on a daily or weekly basis. Um, based on our conversation, we will decide uh, on, on how we want to do that. And then once you receive those emails and with the listing information, you will um, review those homes and let me know which homes you actually like. Um, and again, those homes are based on your specific search criteria. So if you decide you want to have only one story home, three bedrooms, two bathrooms, 2000 square feet and up with a pool or not, so those search criteria, you would let me know. I would put them in into MLS and then send you the information on a regular basis uh, that would apply to specific homes in the area where you would like to live in. As the local expert, uh, I am here a realtor in Florida. I live and I work primarily in Ocotee, which is St. John's County, but I'm also a um, subject matter expert around Jacksonville and San Augustine area, so all the northeast um, region of Florida. So if you would like to purchase a house in Duval County, uh, Flagler County, um, you can certainly let me know, or Clay County as well. I can, um, yeah, I can set up the search for you. And uh, if you're in the area, I can certainly schedule some personal showings for you and sell you any house that you would like in this area. If you found your dream home and would like to make an offer, there's a form called uh, Purchase and Sale Agreement, PASA, that I would help you to fill out with the purchase price that you're offering uh, and the binder, which is the down payment you would like to make to secure the property, along with some other information. I would fill it out for you and send it to you electronically so that you can review it and sign it send it back to me and I will present it to the seller's um, agent or the listing agent. So once the offer is accepted, uh, it goes pretty quickly within 30 or 60 days, the house can be yours. And there are certain steps that I'm happy to share with you. Uh, 
uh, that are part of this process. Like for example, scheduling the, the inspection and getting the repairs uh, all completed before closing date and also getting your loan approved, of course. So once you submit your initial offer, the through obviously with my help, the seller agent uh, needs to review it um, and submit it to the seller. The seller will then review the offer and either accept it or uh, counter offer. If the seller counter offers, then we can certainly have a, a quick discussion to see if we want to submit our own counter offer or if we want to accept the counter. Um, so it's a negotiation process. Sometimes it can go a little bit back and forth, but overall it shouldn't take too much time. Within one or two days, uh, the seller and the buyer should agree on the purchase price. And once uh, the purchase price is agreed on, it takes about 30 to 60 days to close on the property. Now it's time to finalize the financing. So if you were pre-qualified, this shouldn't take long at all. Uh, you need to talk to your lender and always stay very close to your lender. Provide all the information uh, that the lender is requesting for you so that the pre-qualification and then ultimately the um, approval, loan approval can take place and be also finalized um, before closing. I will also work with your lender to provide any information on the property as needed and assist in any way I can. Apart from the lender presenting to you a good faith estimate of the closing cost, we can also ask the closing agent to present to you three days prior to closing a preliminary settlement statement, which will break down and list all the different um, costs that you as a buyer would have to be responsible for, but also um, the seller will have their own list of um, expenses like doing the title search, lien search, and, and so on. I will help you review the settlement statement and make sure that all the cost is accurately described on um, the pre-closing statement. And if there's any discrepancies or any questions, we can certainly discuss them with the closing agent and make sure that we are fully prepared um, to go into closing with your loan approval and fully understanding what costs you will be responsible for. Now, before the big closing day, we will uh, schedule a final walkthrough. We, now that the repairs are all done and you received your um, loan approval and you're cleared to close, we will go back to the property, inspect it and make sure that all the repairs have been finalized and that we are ready to go, uh, go to closing and you know, finalize all the paperwork, sign all the documents so that you can receive your keys and then move in finally into your beautiful new dream home. And now at closing, I will definitely go with you to the closing um, at the title agency's office. We will sit down with the closing agent. We will be reviewing all the documents, signing them, and then you will receive your keys and we will go over to your new property and um, you're ready to move in. And I will help you uh, with any other post moving uh, real estate needs as needed. And of course, I'm always thankful for, for your business and your referrals. Thank you guys. I hope you, this was helpful to you. And if you have any questions, let me know. 904-808-3737. I look forward to working with you. Bye.